Hey everyone, thank you for tuning in for this Confessions. Please take whatever resonates, leave whatever don't. Everything may not resonate with everyone because this is a general message. For those who are new to the channel, I am a psychic medium. There's a lot of proof out there. Uh, it go years back um, and you can look into that. You can look into reviews, uh, past live videos, Q&As that I do here. Um, also live videos that I have done on Facebook just to see the proof, the truth, and accuracy within my readings and how detailed I can see. Um, also, uh, join the channel if you would like to have access to daily messages, um, uh, more messages due to your zodiac sign, extended readings, things like that, uh, monthly readings. Um, just choose whichever membership you like. You can always move up if you want. But if you want more of me, you definitely want to join the channel so you can at least get a daily message, okay? Um, let's jump into this. Confessions, you guys. Let's see what's going on. Um, hmm. No negative energy is welcome here, so remove yourself now. Thank you. All right, so someone is regretting leaving you, and they want to see you. What else, Spirit? Please show us more. I believe the karmic, but now I know the truth. So this is what this confession is about. Things are falling apart for someone. Okay, they want to let you know that. So let's see more with this confessions. Show us more on this energy with this person that's regretting leaving someone. Show us more on this energy. They're looking for you, wanting to uh, come towards you, wanting to choose you. Show us more on this energy. It, could, it was competition. That was the karmic that got involved or got in between you and this person. Show us more. Seven of Swords. There was some deceit, some lies, some trickery going on. And this this person could have lied and they 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 were deceitful towards you. Um, but it's blocked now. There's no communication between you and this person. So if this is someone you're in communication with, this is not that. This is someone that you're not talking to, you don't want to talk to. Um, you lost passion for. Show us more on this energy. Mm. You feel like this person was toxic and, um, yeah, you may have felt, yeah, someone is wanting you back though. That's clearly what they're saying. Um, they want to take a leap towards you, but spirit is telling them to be cautious. I wouldn't do that if I was you. Someone is wanting to come out of the cold with you. Because they're sad and regretting. They're sad and regret here. For some of you, this could have been a situation where you divorced this person. They're wanting to work on love with you. They want to message you, but they're blocked. So this is definitely a blocked connection. It's no longer happening. They're, they're wanting to back towards you they want to tell you some things about the karmic and why they chose to do what they did they were definitely living in low vibrational energy show us a message for this collective spirit for this confessions please show us a message for this confessions Yeah, this person is ready to come out of the cold with you, but there's nothing happening. You're, it's not happening. All right, we have main female. Yeah. S someone feel like... Yeah, like they said, I believe the karma, but now I know the truth. All right, they, uh, someone is held in high honor here, very protected, um, and on a new journey. Some things are taken off quite quickly for someone after leaving this 
Yeah, someone is receiving a gift. And this gift could be unexpected income. You could be the privileged lady or this is this person. Take it however it resonates. Someone's birthday could be on the 17th, the 12th, the 27th, um, or the 25th. Or the number 17, 12, 27, 36, 35. Um, 25 could be significant. Someone could be age 25, age 36, age 35. Uh, the number 8, 7, 9, 3, 88. Someone could be born in 88 or 89, 98, okay, 78, 79, all right. Oh, 29. Hmm. There could be a situation here where someone is getting locked up due to finances, imprisonment. Someone could be just stuck in their head about you, about the situation because things are falling apart. This is someone who tried to do a love spell on you, did a love spell on you. This person could have an addiction to pills and drugs. They're very codependent on it or on you. Um, an, ex stills want, a, an ex still wants you. This is the ex, okay? Whew, no one understands me but you. I can be myself with you. This is how this person is feeling. My pride is what took me so long. Jail. Didn't I mention... So something about jail, okay, um, they could be stuck in their head. I have my family spying on you. Someone could be a Taurus. Mm. They want to confess to you that they're afraid to face you. And a karmic is mentally unstable. Karmic is definitely in this mix, okay. I manipulated you. Someone could be a Scorpio. Karmic is copying the Divine Feminine. Sagittarius. Someone want to confess that they have an STD. And they fell alone without you. Mother really loves you. And they miss their family. So this could be someone you have a child or children with. You are special and you are, you are unique. Nothing like the others. It's a lot of gossip. That's being exposed. They're spying on you through a fake account. And someone is doing black magic. And someone is wanting you to rescue them. I hate it here. They're saying. The karmic know a lot. A lot about you. <sighs> they miss you. Someone tapped or hacked into their phone or this is what they have done to you in the past. Take it however it resonates. Please show us more with this confession. What else, Spirit? Please show us more with this confession. What else do they want to confess? Soulmates. So Soul connection, partnership, agreement, soul contract. This person is feeling like you're their soulmate. Ascending, transcending, obstacles, learning, expansion, new phase, preparing for union. It's in reverse. So someone is not ascending. Someone is still descending. Someone is in a low vibe energy. They're not ready for you. Or this is why this was... Um, it could have been a karmic that came in. Sometimes karmas come in to destroy a connection that's really not meant to be together. And that may have been the case. Um, but this person felt like you are still their soulmate. Um, you are their soulmate once upon a time. But that don't mean you are supposed to stay together forever. Because we have the Grand Reaper. Okay. The relationship is over. No second chances. Grow and transform your life. And that's what you're doing. Girl with a snake, empath, and narcissist. Being charmed or used, enable boundaries. So someone was charming them, and that's what they want to tell you. Um, love call. Someone expresses love, a message of love, thinking of you and letting you know. This person wants to call you, wants to tell you, but you block them. This person is blocked from you. 
because they stabbed you in the back. Heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, shocking attack. So you already, you may have healed from this and moved, moved on. For some of you, this is currently going on, so you could still be um, still wounded from this. But now this person is feeling stabbed in the back because they realized that someone was charming them, using them, and they left a good thing for for a snake. Wow. For the snake. Competition. Enemy. Clever. Malicious. Look over your shoulder. The other woman. A golden mirror. Self-absorbed. Narcissist. One-sided relationship. Love bombing. Mm. So, yeah. But I feel like it, you blocking that situation off is great. It's better than allowing this person in. Because this person is not in high vibrational energy they still have to work on that so if this is meant it will be if it's not it's just over but they said grand reaper the relationship is over no second chances so this could be what you're saying no second chances and that's just what it is you may be meeting someone new um or someone likes you romance is blooming fun, fun flirting and they want to date you Show us more for this confession. <laughs> and I'm here. Oops, I did it again. I need your heart. Hear me maybe one more time. So it could have been the karmic situation who who did this numerous numerous times. I don't know. Um, but oops, I did it again. So they play with your heart. Hit me, baby, one more time. So this person, they could have played with your heart several times. And it looked like they just got their karma. Because whoever this karmic is, they did that to them. So they play with you and now they realize, dang, I played with the wrong one. I want that one back, but they can't have them back. They can't have you back. For Wow, forgiveness. They want you to forgive them. Allow healing waters to wash away the pain of the past. This person wants you to forgive them. Please forgive me. They want you to forgive them. Like, yeah, you could forgive them. That don't mean you have to give them a second chance. And that don't mean I have to talk to you to forgive you. I forgive you. <laughs> like, I forgive you. Now, move on. Friend zone. Someone felt like you friend zoned them. Or not even friend zone. <laughs> you just... You said no friend, no nothing. Okay, I forgive you at a distance. A lack of passion in this compa companionship. Reaching out. Expect a call or text from your person of interest. They may have friend zoned you for this karmic and they're realizing they did the wrong thing. That was, that was dumb. <laughs> like, they like, dang, I messed up. I messed up. I chose wrong. They chose wrong. Um, lasting love, this is your true love. They, This is how this person is feeling. Like you're their true love. They want to bond with you. They feel like you're their dream come true. This person is currently praying for you or you're the one praying for this per person. They feel like you're their perfect match. And the, you're the person that they manifested. And now they're seeing this. But they definitely need to do some, some healing. Because, uh... They're not, they're not ready. Or you're not ready. However this is. You know. Place you wherever you belong in a situation. Please show us more. For this confession and this spirit. Anything else? <laughs> Oops. I did it again. I play with your heart. Show us a message here. What else, spirit? All right. Hmm. This person is fantasizing of you dancing on them and them feeling on you. They're waiting for you. Like, waiting for you to give in to them. Waiting for you to forgive them so that you, they can have another chance. But the Grim Reaper came through. It's over. Yeah, they feel like you're holding back. And you are. That you are. They want to return. They want to turn this around. 360. Turn around. Yeah. 
So I feel like whoever this message is for, you're done. You're like completely done. Like, no. And it's not even, I'm not getting like no hard feelings out of the other person. Whoever this is that's got the, their guards up and blocked this off, no communication. It's not that you you don't, like you hate this person. Um, it, once upon a time you may have or thought you did, you just, you grew from it. You realize, you know, I don't hate you. I just realize you're not for me. Okay, so someone is in that energy and that's because you've healed or you're working on healing and you're just letting this go. No hard feelings, but you just don't want to talk to this person. <laughs> like, look, I can forgive you at a distance. <laughs> All right, but that is today's confessions. Um, please take whatever resonates, leave whatever down the course. And um, don't forget to... Uh, Subscribe if you're new. I hope you enjoy. Look at past videos. Um, and I will get back into uh, Q&As. Um, I will bring that back uh, soon. So be on the lookout for that. Um, and become a member, like I said, if you want to have access to more readings um, pertaining to your zodiac sign and uh, other things. So much more. So become a member, uh, you click on the join button. If you don't see the join button, it's a link in the description of this video. Um, you, If you have an issue with trying to join on your phone, you may need to do it off of a laptop or computer. But after you join, you can always use your phone. It shouldn't be any problems after that, okay? And until next time, you guys, many blessings. Don't forget to like.